Hey guys and welcome back to another follow-up video on the Xiaomi Mi Pad 2 and on this particular video I'm going to share with you uh, the process on how to flash your unit uh, to the MIUI 7 official uh, firmware. Now this unit if you saw the other videos came with a non-official firmware um, and the reasons to flash uh, a unit, uh, at least there are three that I can think of. One of being to uh, get rid of that black screen issue that I did share on the review. Also the YouTube app not working properly. And lastly, to have the, the official firmware uh, installed so that we can have access to online updates, etc, etc. Now, guys, before we begin this, uh, flashing a unit or updating firmware is always risky. So, um, in two things that you need to have in mind. If your unit is working properly, if it's working 100%, um, I would probably avoid uh, flashing the unit. And the other situation is, if you are still here and you are going to proceed with this, please do it at your own risk, because what did work for me could have any issues for other persons. So I cannot be responsible for any mistakes or anything that uh, damages your unit. Hopefully you guys will understand that. Now, if you are still here and you want to see the process, let's begin with it. And the first step it is to uh, go to the official um, website uh, of the Xiaomi and download the MIUI 7 ROM for the Mi Pad 2 and I will leave a link um down below on the video description so that you guys can download it for your computer. Now once we have it on the computer we will need to rename the downloaded file which has a weird name and we just need to uh, rename to update uh, and the name and the, the, the name will be update.zip so we don't need to put the zip there just update. Uh, next we need to connect the Mi Pad 2 to a Windows machine via the USB cable that we have then open the Mi Pad in the File Explorer and copy the update uh, file zip, zip file uh, to the Mi Pad 2 um, folder. Then power off the Mi Pad 2, and after that, we need to press the volume up and the power button at the same time for a few seconds until uh, we see the recovery mode appearing. Now, once uh, we see that menu uh, using the volume uh, button we need to choose the option to install update and then press the power button to select and it will ask us to confirm the action and we just need to press the power button to confirm and it will start uh, the flashing process. Now after it finishes the first step it will ask if we want to reboot to power off wipe and reset or install update which we just did. So all we need to do is to select the reboot uh, option and it will take uh, a while and it will reboot and then it will show a progress bar. Now after that it will reboot again on its own and will show another progress bar that will take a bit longer and I was getting a bit worried here. Uh, expect about four or five minutes, don't worry about that, uh, it is normal. And then once it turns on uh, we will now see everything working and we will have apps that uh, we didn't have before uh, like the update app and so on and so forth and we will have the official MIUI 7 installed on this device which is what I've got at this moment and this solved the black screen issue, solved the YouTube app problem and solved uh, me not having the official MIUI uh, firmware. Guys, this is it, simple as this. Just follow this, uh, these instructions, if you want to call them, uh, and you will have your unit working with no issues at all. At least this was what happened to me. Hopefully this video, along with the other videos that are already published, uh, will help you guys to solve the problems that uh, you are having, if you are on the same boat that I was a few days ago. And hopefully it will help uh, those of you that are considering to purchase this unit, if you want to go through this process or not. That being said, guys, as always, hope that you enjoyed uh, this video. And if you did, don't forget that usual thumbs up. My name is Robert George, and as always, I'll see you on the next one.